Hi everybody, I'm Tom. And I'm Mom. And today on Tom and Mom Play, we're playing... Avatar, Last Airbender, Fire Nation Rising. Yep, uh, if you have ever seen a Rising game before, uh, we've done Thanos Rising on this channel before, it's going to be very familiar to you, and if not, Welcome! Uh, it is a very good jumping in point. Um, and in Fire Nation Rising, it is a cooperative card and dice game for one to five players who take on the roles of Avatar Aang, Katara, so uh, Sokka, Toph, and Zuko as they fight back against the Fire Nation to restore balance to the world. During the first part of the game, we're going to try to recruit heroes from the four nations and battle a variety of villains leading up to the Day of the Black Sun. Once the Day of Black Sun event occurs, players must fight the final battles against the Fire Nation at Wulong Forest, the Fire Nation Palace, and Ba Sing Se in an attempt to end the Hundred Year War. Players must stay ahead of the Fire Nation and succeed in all three battles to win the game. However, if ten heroes or any one team are defeated before this occurs, we lose. Um, that's kind of what you need to know story-wise going in. We are going to be taking turns back and forth, putting our leader chip down into one of three locations on the board. And then we've got this Ozai uh, miniature here facing a location. So the first thing we do is we declare where we want to go. And at that point, we then reveal the Fire Nation, what they're doing. It'll either turn or stay put. Whatever direction he's facing, he'll deal damage to the heroes and activate villains in that location. Um, as well as, there'll be a number for this Ruin track. And this is the Day of the Black Sun. We've got Balance, our side. Ruin, and his side, or the Fire Nation side. Uh, whatever that number is, he goes up the track. First one to reach the end will have the advantage going into uh, the finale of the game. Um, needless to say, if he gets it, it's very bad for us. Uh, if we get it, it's pretty good for us. <laughs> um, but it's more not letting him have the finale. But once we declare where we go, he'll deal damage. Um, and we'll be putting these cubes uh, onto the sides of whoever uh, he's facing. If it fills up at the end of the round, they'll be eliminated. 10 of ours go down, we lose. As well as, if he, uh, say he's going here, I am officially in this location when he is damage, uh, doing damage so nothing happens, but if I was here, he would deal damage to my team as well. Um, and obviously, if I lose my last character, it's game over. What do we do? <laughs> <laughs> Once we are in a location, we, um, based on our teams, Mom, you're playing... Katara. And I'm playing Sokka. And we have a dice pool. They come in the flavors of blue, red, green, and yellow, which will represent the different elements of uh, earthbending, firebending, earthbending, and uh, the avatar, um, the airbending on that yellow. Uh, but I will start with so many dice, two blue, two green. Mom starts exact, uh, exactly the same. Mm -hmm. We'll roll those, trying to get the symbols that are on the heroes or villains, kind of in the middle here. So, for example, where we're at, High Bay here needs uh, two arrows, one fire. And as far as the dice go, they have every symbol on them. However, whatever color they are is uh, more likely to run into uh, a certain symbol. So the blue, more likely to run into water bending, earth bending on the green, and on those as well, they're... Uh, the chance to run into a two times of a symbol, which is great. Uh, so yellow is going to have the avatar symbol, fire, red. You get it. So Hai Bei needs two arrow, one fire. Zhang Zhang needs two fire, two arrow. And the boulder needs two earth, one fire. So what we'll do on our turn is we take our dice, we roll them, and we need to at least assign one die per turn. Um, and then after it's assigned either to one of the cards or to our a hero ability, um, what is your team leader ability? My team leader's ability is she can heal any hero. Yep. Um, so for one water, and you can only do it once per turn, uh, you heal one damage from any hero on the board. And as you only check uh, if heroes are defeated at the end of the turn, um, she can kind of save someone's rear uh, from being uh, knocked out, defeated. The other place that you can assign, and you can only do it onto your own team, 
Um, and some of the characters will have abilities that cost dime. The other uh, spot that you can spend stuff is the balance track. You can go up this once per turn and uh, they're pretty straightforward. Like here, we assign one damage to a villain, you move up. This one, you spend a fire symbol, move up. Discard a pie show, which we haven't talked about quite yet. Um, recruit a, uh, an earth bending hero, remove one die from your pool, straightforward. The only uh, extra thing we have to do is before we can cross the last line is we need to defeat three villains. Uh, these villains are these two darker villains. They have the same uh, kind of the, the, the cost symbols uh, to be able to deal damage. For every set of those symbols you have, you will deal a damage, fill it up. They are removed uh, from the game. We need to defeat three to go up the balance track. And for every damage you do, you get one of these pie show tokens. They will give you one-time benefits. You cash it in during that uh, resolve the dice step. You can't do it uh, any other time, which is a bit of a bummer. Because sometimes it's like, oh no, we're about to lose people. And you draw the one where it's like, oh, I could heal two people. Can't use it at that time. No. Um, it can only go during the um, roll, uh, rolling and uh, assigning die step. Um, but that's the pie show. If for some odd reason when you roll you are not able to do anything that I have just talked about, you get a mercy pie show. <laughs> Um, that, in a nutshell, is what you need to know. Once this gets up to the top, we'll kind of explain a bit more. But the how we win the game, these uh, three battles will be shuffled, put out onto the field. Once we And they work just like villains or recruiting heroes. Once we have accomplished one of those, or uh, once we've accomplished all three of those, we win the game. Um, otherwise, that's, I think that's everything folks need to know. Thank you covered pretty good. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah. Um, I'm going to get my rule book out and ready just to be on the safe side so I can follow follow down through. So, uh, would you like to go first or second today? I'll go with second. You'll okay. go second. Okay. Well, I know one we need to recruit people. And Saka, his ability down here is I get plus 1 blue or pl uh, red die. Uh, if either hero adjacent to Saka is blue or red. We haven't talked about assigning or um, the adjacency or where we put characters down. Uh, we'll get into that when we recruit our first. But just know, adjacency matters. And once a character is placed, and they can only go to the left or the right of your line, once they're placed, that's where they're at. You're, you're not going to be able to swap them around unless ability something says otherwise. So I think I'm going to be decent coming off up here. Because I'm going to try to hit this pirate captain. Um, and try to get uh, Hakoda here as uh, one of the blue. Yeah, I think I'm. I think I'm decent going here. Uh, I already know what my starting dice pool is, but before that happens, uh, so place the team token. Done. We need to reveal and resolve the Fire Nation card. Okay. If you want to set it f down that way, that way we can. It, it's easier to see. <laughs> which way he turns. Um, and obviously we have our three zones uh, as denoted by the color, which is really nice, or by the puzzle piece board here. So he's going to turn, sadly, he's coming my way. Okay. Yep, yeah, but the good news, the ruin track doesn't go up any. So he will take a damage. They will take a damage. Pirate Captain, active player, discards all pie shows. I don't have any, so it's not that bad. But Sokka will take a hit. And now we go into the roll and assign hero dice and hope we do well. Oh, and I forgot to say, my ability uh, with Sokka is Master Plan. If I spend a water, I can leave any one assigned but unused die on a hero or villain card for the next player's turn. Um, which can be really nice. It can be very helpful. That can help a lot. So let's see. To recruit Koda, I would need two water and an arrow to hit the pirate captain. I need a water and a fire. Um, okay, I've got my arrow. Good job. Thank you. I've got a fire. I'm missing water. So, I can assign as many dice uh, as I want to on as many cards as I want, which, if you played a rising game before, especially Thanos, that's different. Um, we, for the first time we played this, we played that very wrong, because uh, we got so used to only being able to assign to one card at a time. 
Um, but you can assign to as many as you are able to, uh, but you must assign or discard at least one. So I'll go ahead and roll. Earth, darn, neither of the two do me any favors. I need water specifically, so I'm going to go ahead and discard this because I have nowhere I can place it. Not board, not my hero ability. And this I'm rooting for at least a water. Come on, water. I have a water, so I'm not going to be able to recruit, but I can pirate captain. Hit him for one, which takes us up the balance track, puts a damage. And do you want to pass me a pie show? Sure. There you go. Thank you. Uh, because, yep, uh, we resolved the hero dice. We kind of did that a little bit quickly. Um, and this uh, pie show will get a free water symbol. Would have been great. <laughs> a couple minutes ago. <laughs> would, would, would have been great a couple minutes ago. But that is the end of my turn. Play goes over to mom, and right. you place your team token. Um. Um, your ability down here, you get a free blue or yellow die if either hero adjacent is a blue or a uh, one of the yellow. So either a water or a uh, the air avatar symbol. In the, in, the, in the book, it's listed as Avatar. I'm going to call it Air, or I'm going to call it Colors a lot. Um, go for a blue one, I guess. Okay. Nope. You're going to go where I was? Yep. Okay. Because the nice thing, you might be able to take out that uh, Pirate Captain, too. Yep. So, next step, reveal and resolve the Fire Nation card. Whoops. So the good news is he's turning. Um, but what is the bad stuff over here? From this villain, plus one damage to all water and earth heroes in this location. These are sadly both water heroes. Normally you put dice until it fills. We just move them up and down mm -hmm. to just save on these because we, we have ran out of cubes in Rising games <laughs> before. Um, we're, we're notorious for doing it. Uh, so it just it works a little easier for us. Uh, but great job, no hits. I'll get this put back up here. Thank you. You have the same dice pool I do. So, nope. That's it. I, I'm just, for the sake of camera. Yeah. Try not to move the tray. All right. Because <laughs> I, I, I want to do the same thing. It's like, <laughs> I, I want to pull this down. But, so the folks at home can see what we're doing. Ooh, that's not bad. Um, you could currently... So, mom rolled double water. Uh, fire, fire, fire. You could um, put the double onto him. Or, uh, because he needs the double, uh, double water and an arrow... He needs one water, one fire, which you do currently have, but you would be one arrow away from getting him. Why don't we take a, uh, put it on the bad guy? Put it on the bad guy? Yeah. Okay. And go ahead and roll. Now you're looking for um, water, double water and an arrow. You got a, you got an arrow. Ooh. If I spend my token, because I, I can spend it on her turn, you could recruit him right now. That'd be great, thank you. Yeah, so let's do that. I will spend my pie show. Upon recruiting, they are magically healed. And remember, you gotta pick what side he goes on to. No, put him on this side here. And what is his ability? Plus one pie show if Hakoda or either Jason hero is damaged on your turn. So that that's really good. Uh, and now, you also defeat the pirate captain. Mm -hmm. So, you will grab a pie show. Alrighty. I'm going to put this over to here. Got an earth. Got an earth symbol. Okay, not bad. Uh, and now, we will go ahead. There is Uncle Iroh and the Mechanist. Our oot in a boot. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's get your deployment token back. Thank you. So, yep, we resolved here at Ice. We've concluded the turn. Play comes back over to my side. I need a recruit. That's just what has to happen. I sure that that's a dangerous spot for both of us because that dude deals double damage to water um, water benders. But Arnook's pretty easy to try to get a hold of. Uh, so all right, I just hope he doesn't stay put. So flip okay. it. See what I can do here. 
Okay, the good news is he turns. Uh, so, damage, damage, damage. Uh, ruin zero, that still has not gone up one. <laughs> it's dangerous getting all the zeros out this early. Yeah. It's nice, but it's scary. Keep all the hard stuff for the bottom. Yeah. Yeah, that's... <laughs> we, we know how this goes. Oh, yeah. All right. So, um, we have revealed Resolve the Fire Nation card. Now roll and assign hero dice. Um, I need two water symbol for you. I need... Oh, I can hit him right now. Yeah, I think I'm going to want to do that. But I'm going to save my waters to try to recruit. So let's see what happens. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Double water. Come on. I got a single water. Which, with you... Oh, you have an earth symbol. Yeah. Oh, ho, ho. Yeah. Okay. That's, that's bad. Um, well, if I get a fire symbol, this is going up. If I get a water symbol, that's going up. If I get anything else, nothing's happening. I've been in. I got an arrow. Oh, God, right. Nothing's happening. So, this unfortunately goes away. Um, but the good news, I do deal damage to him. So, do you want to pass me a pie show, please? Might as well leave those there. It is a... Ooh, re-roll all unassigned die. That's pretty nice. Well. I'll pull this back. No one's been defeated. Um, You're up. Let's see. I probably should recruit or do a bad guy or something. Yeah. yeah. All, all of, all of these are stuff. good things, yeah. Over there. Yep, he's... This, this up here is our only villain okay. on the board right now. Okay. So if you're trying to hit a villain, that's not a bad spot to go. Go there. Yep. All right. Do you want to flip the Fire Nation card? All right. He is going to turn down there. Yeah. <laughs> this is why I always try to keep it facing one way so it's easier to figure out which way he's turning. The Ruin Track does go up one. And everyone here eats a damage. And you're not there, so that's not too bad. Now, your dice pool changes. So you will get a bonus blue or a yellow. I'll take a Both are good for everyone here. The Fire the Fire Nation would prefer the yellow. Both of these prefer the blue. If you're trying to recruit more. I'll go with the yellow. Okay. Try to hit him. Yep. Alright. Good luck. Thank you. I believe in you. You need one arrow, one earth. Two water for him, two water, two earth for who? Well, you got your arrow and an earth. Um, so if we spend, because we know this has more arrows, nothing else needs arrows, right? Right. So if we spend these, that'll take him out. Oh. You do have two water right now. You could currently get Arnuk. You can currently re-roll. Or you could try to go for who here who would get you. Because um, if you put your two water here, you mm -hmm. can hope to try to get a earth. If you get an earth or the double earth, you get him. Okay. Or you get Arnuk right away. I'm going to go for this one. You're going to go for him? Yeah. Okay, so you're going to put both both the waters down? Um, okay. And... Good luck. See what I can do here. Yep, you just need an earth. And if you don't get earth, fire's not a bad alternative. You got the double earth. <laughs> Great job. Thank you. So, the double earth goes down. So, you will... Rec so, we now resolve We, we now resolve everything. So, yeah. you receive him. Yep. Uh, either side's not bad. They, they both have their benefits. Uh, put him on this side. All right. That's a rounder there. <laughs> yeah, which is good because you'll get her bonus die for that. You also take out the Fire Nation soldier. Nicely done, which will get you a new pie show. Uh, free blue die, die, which is great. All right, you get that back. We need to reload. Hama's, oh, we, we have problems with Hama. She, she's the one where you have to pick the one. She deals damage to everyone adjacent. She is, she, oh, and the Fire Nation ship. 
Ooh. That's a bad location. Ooh. Oh boy. Ouch. Oh. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Yikes. And the worst part is I only I only have Sokka. But that Arnix is one of the easiest for me to try to recruit. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Do I dare? Or I could or I could come down here because the the boulder would be great. Um, he he's not gonna give me more dice though. Jung Jung, he's gonna be hard to get. Oh, I think I'd risk the biscuit. Okay. Here flip, we go. flip, 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 flip the bad stuff. Flip the bad stuff. He stays put, and ruin goes up one. Okay, this isn't as bad as I thought. We could work it. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's fine. Um, okay. I feel like I'm missing a die somewhere, but I probably put, probably moved it somewhere it doesn't need to be. Um, all right, I need water. I need water galore. Come on, water. I got a water. I got a fire. Part of me almost wants to spend the fire just to go up this track. Yeah, yeah so I'm going to do that. The water... I need I need to recruit. I would love I would love to hit villains, but I need to recruit. Oh. <laughs> uh, I well, one, I could I could straight up get him right now. Uh -huh. But with what I have, I could also hit that Fire Nation ship. I I need to recruit. I need the bonus die. Um, do I get anything <sighs> That's not going to matter any. Cool. So, into the turn. I already had this go up. Yep. So I can pull that. Welcome to the team. Here we come. I'm going to put you on this side. So right now it doesn't matter. But I'll get a bonus blue or uh, red die. I start of my turn, which is great. And Jody, we have a full area of villains. <laughs> so we know if we roll that way, it's bad. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Jody, 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 no. and the worst part is, uh, her, hers makes hitting that side really hard, because her ability is dice may not be assigned to other villains in this location. You have to smack her first, and she's the only one you can smack if you go there. That is a very dangerous side of the board. Jody, <laughs> Jody. <laughs> Jody, Jody. And what does it take to smack her? Uh, it takes it one arrow, one earth. So it is possible. We, we it, the other thing is, it would be good to get over there and knock those out as quick as we can. Well, we just hope Ozai doesn't turn that way. Here goes nothing. Woo! Risk it for the biscuit. All right, flip, uh, flip the Fire Nation card. Please. He stays put and ruin. Goes zero. That's not so bad. Um, two blue, two green. Uh, other thing of note, I probably should have mentioned earlier. If for some odd reason you would need to roll more dice than are available of a certain color, too bad. <laughs> you don't just re-roll anything. You are component limited. You get a bonus blue. Should I take my use that one? It's not a bad idea. Yeah, so you'll get a free bonus blue. I'll put it over here. And seeing you're rolling all the blues, mm -hmm. uh, we will give you the bonus yellow for okay. Katara. Oh. So, because who gives you a bonus blue? Okay. Here, let's, let, let's for, for, for the sake of those at home. <laughs> your dice pool is two blue, two green. Okay. Who gets you a blue? blue. Katara gets you a blue, blue or a yellow, yeah. but seeing you're spending your token, yep. that'll get you a blue. Well. We're out of blues. <laughs> so... Taking the yellow as the bonus. Oh, Alrighty. Now, the other thing we may want to do... Um, so, on this turn, to go up the balance track, mm -hmm. is we need to discard a pie show. Let me do mine. Mine's not bad. Because I have the reroll all right. on assignment. We don't have to do it this second. Okay. But at least by the end of the turn. Right. So, we can save that until... We can, we can, we can save it. Because she takes an earth to hit. Uh-huh. And I can give you a reroll, so... There we go. We can work this out. Yeah, we, we, we can... Um, okay, this... This is interesting. 
This is this is a very good roll, by the way. Thank you. So, Hama's the one that we really need to take down first, because she's the one that deals damage to everyone on the left right. of your team, and that's whenever she goes there. It's not just this location. Right. So, that plus this hits her once. We would need two more water to hit her. If you put this on Jody, okay. that will hit her once. Or you could do this on the Fire Nation ship, but rolling more blue is not bad. We'll do that. There we go. So all you need. Now, the other thing you could do is you could put this one onto her right now and hope you just roll another water symbol. You don't have to get lucky and get the double. Why don't we do that? Okay. <laughs> so you just need to roll one more, one more water symbol. Come on, water, 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 water. Water, water, water. Water. You, you got the double one. <laughs> Nicely done. Thank you. Uh, and with that, actually, you can do something really cool right now. <laughs> if we put this on Jody, 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 yeah. and you spend this on Jody, <laughs> you can take them both out. And I will discard my reroll all unassigned die to go up. And you get four Pi Show tokens. Four? You get, yep, yeah, because you hit her twice and you hit Hama twice. Okay, I got a water. Perfect. And a earth. Another earth. earth. Oops, sorry. And a, another, another earth. earth. And for your last trick. And a green. Yep, and a free green die. Not bad at all. Mom is definitely our MVP right now. Brandon Shaw and Avatar Roku. Um, and at least I'm finally getting a bonus die. Yay. I know. Um, our next thing up is we need to recruit a green hero. The only one who's available is the boulder. So I think I'll go after him. Um, do you want to... <coughs> excuse me. Card. Yep. Flip card. Okay, he is turning this way, and the ruin track is going to go up to, to, Catch to that he is. All right, so That's two green, two blue, <laughs> and I get a bonus red or a blue because I have a water adjacent, and Arnook, uh, after rolling, I can re-roll any unused die before assigning. I got the free reroll, which is great. And mom's got symbols galore to try to help me out. Yep. Um, I'm going to take a bonus red because both of these two take fire. Oh, he takes fire too. So, yeah, I might as well. Let's see what I can do. Look. Thank you. Well, not a single fire symbol. Um, I kind of want to take the free reroll. Yeah, I'm going to use Arnuk's ability to reroll because I'd prefer the double mountain to try to get the boulder. Right. Which, of course, I don't get. Okay, so I do have to put down at least one. Okay, I have my fire symbol I'm looking for. So I need I need another earth symbol. Which granted you you can, can help do, me out with. I can help you out with that. Oh, cock die, I'll re-roll. So I do get him, which is great. Um I'm gonna re-roll these. I'm gonna put high bay. I'll give you that. If I can roll my water, I could save you that for high bay if you want to come here and try to get him. Because he's good with Katara. Um, plus he also has healing. Nope. Did not roll what I needed to be able to save that for you. But I do at least recruit Yay. Boulder. And I'm going to put him on the outside. Uh, I'm going to put him on this side here. He has an ability, any damage that would be assigned to the adjacent hero is assigned to the boulder instead. I have recruited a green hero, so that will go up. As well as new card coming out. 
Uh oh, Admiral Zhao. He's one we need to take out fairly quick. Uh, every time Zhao, uh, Ozai turns to Zhao, the ruin track goes up by one. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, so he, he accelerates the end game. Uh, that is everything taken care of. You need to pick where you're going. The next spot up here, by the way, is remove one die from your pool at the start of your turn. We'll take us up one, which you would be the good one for that. Because yeah. you roll a lot of dice. Yeah, we'll do that. But go ahead we'll and pick where you're going. Now we need to take him out. He takes earth. two earth, two water, and you have to hit him three times. Oh. And I mean, recruiting these guys that are low on health would be a great idea too. Two. All right, let's get your dice pool ready. Two blue, two green. Yep. A free blue, well, from who you get a blue. Yep. From Katara, you get either a yellow or a blue. Both are good here. If you're trying to hit him more, uh, you're going to want blue. If you're going to try to recruit Haibei or Zhang Zhang, uh, yellow would probably be your preferred. Give me blue one. You're going to take blue. Okay. Um, and we need to flip a card? No, because... Wait. Yeah, did we not flip a card? I don't think we flipped a card. Or did he... Because did he just turn that one? No, he didn't just turn that... Did he just turn that way? No, because I didn't damage anybody. Okay. Yep, flip a card. My apologies. That's okay. Um, he is turning, unfortunately, back our way. So this will go up one. Uh, damage to Haibei, damage to Zhang Zhang. You will take damage to everybody, but Hakoda's power will go off. So you will get a Pai Show. I'm gonna make sure we're far enough up on this track. Um, uh, Earth symbol. So we should be up one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Okay. Okie doke. Yep. yep. Sorry, microphone. I didn't mean to bump you. Um, okay, so back to building your dice. Yep. Two blue, two green. A blue. You were gonna take the blue for this. Yep. Um, do you want to take the bonus green and maybe just discard it or remove it to go up this track? Yep. Okay. I'll do that. Cool. I'll put that over here. Perfect. Alrighty. Go ahead and roll. See what you can do. High bay would be great to recruit. Uh, but so would hitting. What's his face? You need two arrows, which you currently have, and a fire. Which would get you high bay right now. Um, two water. You'd be you'd be an earth away from hitting him once, or you could re-roll these and hope you run into doubles. Uh, re-roll. Okay. So you're gonna be getting high bay, which is great. Um, so you must assign one of them. I would probably assign at least the one water here. Because out of tokens, you can at least smack them once right yep. now. Alrighty. And the other thing we got to remember too is you have your healing power. Oh. You got your double earth. Okay. Uh, a second double earth isn't going to do you any favors here, I'm afraid. Because of we're short of water. <laughs> so if you want to roll it again, try to get a water for your ability. Okay. <laughs> or uh, that, or either way, you wouldn't have to spend a token. Okay, that's if that's not bad. So you will deal a damage here. So you will grab a pie show. Ooh, nice. Mine is one damage from two heroes. Habe comes to you. Um, Say, so would he be better on right here? Put him here just to go with Hakoda. Okay. He's so cute. He's so cute. And so he, he, he's got a bit of an oddity. Uh, if Haibei has three or fewer damage, you can heal one from any hero. That's just free. So every turn you're going to get to heal until he's up to three. Otherwise, plus one additional uh, Pai Show for each uh, damage assigned to a villain. 
Not bad. Not bad at all. New card, another baddie is out. Uh, Combustion Man. Uh, the other thing I don't think I put in the beginning, I'll have to try to put it in the lower third for the opening, is on our uh, setup here, we are playing on the easiest on the balance track, but we have every villain in the deck. Gotta remember to add that. <laughs> um, but that was, uh, and what's Combustion Man do? Plus one damage to all Avatar and Fire heroes in this location. So, not bad. Not bad turn. Uh, the next thing on our track we need to get is the double avatar symbol. Oh, should I come and try to smack some baddies? Yeah, we, we need to try to hit Zhao while we can. So I'm going to go here. You want to flip the Fire Nation card. Oop. There you go. <laughs> Ruin track goes up one. He is going to turn. <laughs> I don't know why that's his turn noise, but... And plus one damage to all Avatar and Water heroes in this location. So Avatar Roku will take a hit. Alright. Two blue. Two green. And I get a bonus blue or red. I'm going to take the bonus blue. Red, uh, red would be great because I could try to save Zhang Zhang. But uh, I'm going to go this way. Because I want to try to smack Zhao as much as we can. And with your symbols. Yep. The new sculpts. Yep. Okay. I'm going to use my free reroll. Because <laughs> I did not roll worth a darn. So, using Arnux ability. Two water. Perfect. You have two earth. But the question is, because I want to take, I want to take them out as quick as we can. Right. Um. And we need to hit him twice. Yeah. Because I've got two earth here. You have two earth there. But I need, I need another water. So I assigned. I'm gonna reroll. I'm gonna reroll. See what we get. There's two more water. Yeah. Perfect. Now I need earth galore. There's a double earth. And a single earth. You know, that's not bad. Yeah. But if I can roll these into arrows, I can maybe get us up that track. Or I can root for the double earth so we don't have to spend anything. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. Well, I got a single arrow. Can I get the other? No. Okay. That's okay. So, this will be wasted. This, we're going to have to spend one of your tokens. Mm -hmm. But the good news is He's Admiral going. Zhao is... Going bye-bye. He goes bye-bye. He's going bye-bye. And do you want to pass me two pie shows, please? I thank you. You're welcome. I uh, get water and a minus one damage from two heroes. That's great. That's really great. I'll take this back. New card out is Hockey. <laughs> You're cute. Well, you are up. Um, we need to take out. Let's see. Realistically, we need to try to get up that track. What do we need next? Double yeah. arrow. Arrow. Which so you're gonna want to take your yellow. Um. So we got a bad one on this side. Yeah, the bad one down there. We'll go here. You going there? Okay. Draw the Fire Nation. I'm afraid you have a friend. All right. Um. So ruin goes up one. Damage to Zhang Zhang. He will drop at the end of the turn. Currently one to here. Everyone on your team takes a hit. I'll get you one for high bay. Alrighty. And plus one damage to all uh, avatars, so high bay and all fire heroes in this location. So high bay takes a second hit. Alrighty. There we go. Okay. Um, two blue, two green, a bonus blue, and you want to take the yellow? Yellow. Yellow. Oh, and. 
if uh, plus one pie show if Hakoda or either adjacent hero was damaged on your turn. So go ahead and take a pie show. A water. Uh, Not bad. Here we go. See what we can do here. Yep. And we gotta remember you have a free heal. Yep. Okay. We've got one arrow. Um, you technically have two arrows. If you spend both the die. Yep, we'll do that. So that'll take that up. Yep. Um, saving him would be great, but it's hard. Because you need... Or a hidden combustion man would be great, too. Does he yeah, fire? Yep, two fire, two arrow. Yeah. Combustion man takes two arrow and a water. You're going to want to use Haibei's ability at some point, as yeah. well as maybe Katara's to try to save some butts here in a minute or two. Yeah. Uh, but it's up to you how and when you want to do stuff. Um, I'm going to try to save him. Okay. So, yeah, you're definitely going to want to re-roll. You've already assigned. Yeah. Good luck. Thank you. Two fire, two arrow. It's going to be tough because you would need perfect dice for it. And I'm afraid perfect <laughs> dice didn't happen. Because, yeah, you, you there's no way for you to get the double arrow or the double fire with the dice you have left. Right. So going after him is not a possibility. Right. You could still go after Combustion Man or you could go after Hockey. Um... You could also use her power to heal and high base power to heal. Let's do that. Okay, so if you're using her power, okay. there's the one there. there. Off John, John, yep. John. Yep. Okay, and high base you can heal. Any, well, same thing as hers. You can heal one off of anybody. How's your sitting over there? Buddy? I'm not bad at all. So Sokka's only taken a hit. Let's see. We do have. Hmm? Go ahead. Anybody on the board? Hockey's one away. And yeah, that's that's it. But down, but down here, it doesn't matter a ton because if he comes back here, he's gonna hit for the kill anyway. Yeah. So you you might as well take it off them or off high bay. Wouldn't be bad either. I'll take it off a of high bay. Okay. Unless it's this yeah, one. It's your panda. My panda? Yeah. There we go. There you go. I mean, we, we both still have our spendy tokens, which yep. is great. Go ahead and re-roll. Alrighty. Two fire or a water and two arrows. Would be the great thing. You got an arrow. I think that is currently the only thing you can spend. Good luck. Thank you. Another arrow would be perfect. You could always spend the token and at least do a damage. Another arrow, perfect. Go ahead and roll this one last time. Because now you're looking for the water so you don't have to spend the token. Nope. So, spend the token. Weapon. Which will hit him. Once. And get you a new pie show. Get a fire. fire. Not bad. There we go. All right, these dice here. Your thingy comes back here. No one has been defeated. Thank goodness. Oh, thank you. <laughs> the, the, the dice are going everywhere. Um, <laughs> God, I should go there and just try to take him out. Yeah, I'm probably better served coming here. Okay, Fire Nation. Of course he stays put. That happens. He does damage to everybody here. So, the boulder's gonna take two, because he's gonna take one for Sokka. Because any damage that would be assigned to aid Jason heroes, go to him instead. Um, he'll go down, he'll go down. Every avatar and fire here on this location takes another. They're maxed. Anyway. Yep. So, I need to grab my die. Yep. yep. Two blue. Two green and a red or a blue. I'm going to take the red because I need fire symbols. Okay. Um, the good news is we have our tokens to try to save their butts, so I'm not too concerned. And I've still got my free reroll. 
see what we can do. Let's do fire. But I'm gonna take the reroll. After rolling, you may reroll any unused dice before signing. So I prefer the double fire. And of course, do I get the double fire? No. Um, okay, I'm gonna put this here, no arrow. There is double arrow, so I can at least take out Combustion Man. There is double fire to grab Hockey. And if I could borrow one of these, we can go up this track. Go for it. Yep. And sadly, I can only go up once, once in a turn because I'm about to recruit a red hero. <laughs> I wish you could go up more than once, yeah. but nope, it is... No, it's one. It is once in a turn. Uh, you may advance a balance token a maximum one space per turn by paying the cost. Uh, yeah. yeah. But the good news is hockey is part of the team. Move one damage from any hero to any other hero. Ooh, yeah, I'm going to put you next to the boulder. I think <laughs> that's actually helpful. And we take out Combustion Man. Um, oh, actually, before I do that, I'm going to spend my... Heal one from two. Heal Zhang Zhang one. And I'm going to take one off the boulder. There you go. Yep. So that way he doesn't drop. But Combustion Man goes away. I get a new Pai Show. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, heal two damage from any one hero. Not bad. Not bad. Uh oh. Lung Fang. And Master Paku. So now we need to recruit a red hero <coughs> to go up that track. I'll take this back. You are up. Let's see, red's on. There's red in every location right now. Okay. I'll go here. Okay. Yeah, try to save him. Yep. Okay, not bad. Um, draw the Fire Nation. Go for there, come on. Okay, he is turning this away and ruin track up by one. You take a damage, you take a damage, and you take a damage. Not bad. Two blue, two green. And you get a bonus blue. You get a yellow or a blue. If you're trying to recruit him, yellow is your best option. Yellow, please. Congratulations. <laughs> uh, no one on your team took damage, so Haku's ability, or sorry, Hakoda <laughs> doesn't go off, and High Bay you can still use, and that's the heal somebody yeah. won. Yeah. Um, no one is threatening to drop, so it's just boosting somebody. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Thank you. That is enough for Zhang Zhang. Or you could currently hit Long Fang. Or, with what you have... Ooh, this might not be a terrible option. Um, if you put this here, mm -hmm. you would just need one arrow to hit him. If we put this here, you would need... Actually, if I give you this, you could recruit him if you spend a fire or roll this to try to get a fire. Let's see if I can get a fire. Okay, so you want to try to recruit him instead of hitting him. He He's rough, but not the worst for us. Oh, maybe I'll hit Because he, he has a great power for us, which is change water to any symbol. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so and so right now, you, you can get it. Uh -huh. Because you have the token to get it. You might be able to save us a token, depending on what you roll. You need a what? Um, either a fire or a water. Come on. Neither. Neither one. <laughs> Neither one. So, if nope. we bo spend both of our tokens here, you now get Master Paku. Put him on that side. Sure. And you get, also, this is, this is super good, because Jong Jong does the same thing as him, but with fire symbol. Mom is definitely our MVP right now. There we go. Now, the scary thing is, he's pretty close to the top. So are we, but we can only go up once per turn. 
Um, uh, Chitsang, as well as Zula. She's actually, I'm glad she's out now. Because she takes damage away from all other villains. We ran into her uh, when we were playing this yesterday, and she was a very big problem. Yeah. She's a very nice lady. <laughs> yeah, uh, so, so surprisingly how I remember stuff some days, we do actually do some practice rounds of games. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh, but yeah, Az Azula, Azula was rough yesterday. Um, and t it, she, much like Long Fang, takes three hits to do. Um, so I need a fire and a water symbol to go up the next. Hmm. Where am I better served? Jitsang. Um. I mean, I should try to smack bad guys while I can. Because heroes, I'm not doing terrible. Really not bad in that regard. Um, they mechanist uh, mechanist might he's not bad either. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna go after him because you get a free pie show if you are in a location with a villain. We've got villains out right now, so I think he might be the way to go. But you want to flip the the bad stuff. Yeah, of course he stays put, and this goes up too. He's likely gonna trigger. <laughs> Because we've ran through most of our zeros. Um, so, damage here. He will take one, two, three damage due to <laughs> my craziness with the boulder. Um, you take a damage, you take a damage, and you take a damage. So, two are threatening to be bye bye. Uh, two blue, two green, a red, or a blue. Well, if I want to go off that track, I want red. And the question is, if there's a tie for the ruin, uh, for the Day of the Black Sun, Day of the Black Sun, if either reach at the top, we can tie him. If we both reach it, because we don't check it until the end of the turn. Right. It's, it's part of the conclude uh, turn step. If we're both up there, uh -huh. We get the advantage. Yay. So we, ha we, ha we have a shot at it. I'm, I'm going to have to roll it well. Um, we have stuff to heal those guys so we don't lose them. I think I'm probably better off just focusing on trying to get that. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to take a red as my bonus die. So I'm only rolling the five. I need fire and water. Uh, do we want to spend your pie show to at least heal those two up? Yeah. Or we could hold it till the end of the turn. Wait, Just in case, yeah. See what happens here. See what happens. Um, okay, I got my fire for this. I need water. Sadly, that's not a water I can use. Um, I can put. I could put a fire in an earth or a water or that in an earth there, and hope I roll water off of these two. Because I could use an earth to grab him, which saves his butt. Okay, okay. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna use my free reroll off of Arnuk. <laughs> That's not good. Oh no. Well, the good news is I save him. The bad news is I have one roll and I have to try to get water. <laughs> Otherwise, I may have just ruined our uh, big chances here. Oh no. Man, water. Oh no. Man, water. Water, water, water. It's an arrow. Oh. oh no. Oh no. It's okay. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> well, we have to hope there's another zero in that deck. Um, <laughs> so, I rescue the mechanist. Um, I could. I'm gonna spend my pie show. To heal him too, so that way no one no one's dropping this turn. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Uh, Grand Grand's out. Alrighty. Um, yeah, your yeah. your turn. <laughs> A 
the best part is I um, for for those who have watched other videos on our channel, there's um, uh, Alyssa who's played cooperative games with me. Who, if she's seeing this at all, is laughing her head off because she knows I always make the wrong choice. <laughs> Uh, watch, watch her play through a Burgle Bros uh, with, with uh, your, your your girl's uh, your your doctor saw uh, now, uh, just just to see what I mean. It's it's pretty bad. <laughs> I don't know where to go. <laughs> Same in all honesty. Um, I mean, you you get to change symbols. You might want to smack some baddies. Well, if I go here. Yeah, it's it's a little dangerous, but. Well. <laughs> I'll flip his over. We'll nope. see if. They, <laughs> nope. Well, yeah. So the day of the black sun doesn't happen if we don't flip cards. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. Oh, <gasps> it's a zero. Yeah. He stays put, and it's a zero. Take a hit, Grand Grand. <laughs> Take one for the team. <laughs> Thank you. Uncle Iro is going to drop at the end of this turn. Um, you can save him with high bay. Uh, but oh my god. <laughs> Two blue, two green, a blue. A partridge and a pear tree. A partridge and a pear tree. <laughs> we're, we're, we're in the holiday season. It, it works. Uh, you get a free blue or a yellow. Um, yellow if you're trying to smack some baddies. Yellow. Yellow it is. There's all your stuff. Thank you. Uh, do you want to use your freebie to heal Uncle Iroh? Yep. Cool. Oh, there's hope. But then it comes back to me to try to roll the three for the next turn. Anywho. Oh, anywho. <laughs> okay. So. <coughs> Excuse me. You have a water for this. There's no fire for that. Um, except, actually, let's bring this back because you have change symbols galore stuff. Yep. Uh, you don't have fire, but you have a water. You can change water to anything. So if you change your water to a fire... We'll do that. Uh, that takes that. We'll put the water here. So this is done. Except for we have to get past the last one. Yeah. Um, do you want to re-roll? i re-roll. Okay. What do we need for the last one? You can't do the last one. I can't do the last one. Because you can only do once per turn. Once per turn. Yep. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Comes back to me to save our bacon. You can do it. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay, you have a double arrow, and you have a double water, which is good enough to hit her right now. Okay, we'll do that. Which is great, in all honesty. Um, you could change a fire symbol to water to use her ability. Do that. So you can heal one from anybody. You're sitting, are you sitting over there? I'm not awful. Mine aren't too bad. You put it in the board and you'd save? Uh, Uncle, well, we you already healed Uncle Ira once. Um, the master here, uh, they're both one away from dropping. Oh, why don't you do that one this time? Okay. <laughs> Um, I don't think there's anything you can do with that last die. Probably not. No. So, good turn. Thank you. Very good turn on saving our bacon. Um, she will take a damage. You will get a new pie show. A fire. Uh, you have two of the symbols that we need for the next trip up. <laughs> so you may save our bacon. Okay. With no help from me. I'm gonna go here. Oh, I'm gonna see if I can hell? smack her. Thank you, Mama. Um, actually, I think I'm better served up here, so I can try to smack him. Um, flip the last. Oh, that's gonna be hard to pick up. So he turned this way, which is bad. Um, I mean, it's not that bad. He takes a damage, plus one damage to all Earth and Fire heroes in this location. So he'll take a bonus minus one damage from all other villains. We don't care. There. He advances to the end. We knew it was coming. Yeah. Um, so this is the last chance we have to tie him for that, and we take the advantage going in. Yeah. Um, 
we'll explain Day of the Black Sun once we get to it. It's, it's about to happen. Um, so, two blue, two green, a red, or a bonus blue from my stuff. And I get a free pie show for plus one if my team is in a location with a villain. I picked out a good one. Thank you. Uh, a free green die. Um, I'm going to take a blue die. And I'm going to hold that for now. Because with yours, all I need is a water symbol. <laughs> I have a free reroll. <laughs> Come on, water. First shot. Come on, water. That'd be great. Come on. Okay. We have water. We have water. <laughs> um, you need... Because well, if I can try to take out this ship, that'd be great. While we're at it. So now I just need... Another water. Come Actually, water. A, a double water would be preferred. Come on, water. Neither are water. I'm going to use my... Uh, after rolling, I can re-roll before assigning. There is the double water. water. Okay, this somewhat worked out. I got one die left. It's not going to matter. Cool. Cool. Okay, if... Oh, actually, it did matter. Because if uh, for putting it there, I could have saved us some tokens. But that's okay. End of the turn. We hit this twice, which is good enough to knock it out and pass me over two pie shows. I get a free earth and an avatar symbol, which is great. Um, let us refill. Jet comes out and we are now officially on the day of the black sun. This ruin and balance track goes bye bye. We have the advantage which is good, meaning any t uh, anyone with this Day of the Black Sun symbol would come off the board. Mm -hmm. If he made it there, that'd be all the heroes. Now it's going to be all the villains with that symbol, which currently is none. Mm -hmm. uh, but why it's dangerous for us with that symbol is anyone with that symbol comes off. And they are considered defeated mm -hmm. for the sake of the ten defeated heroes. Um, so that's why we want to avoid that. And any new one that comes out with that symbol would also be problematic um do you want to shuffle those sure because that ran out so the rune track no more we don't have to worry about it um but we now have three locations uh, about to come out that we're gonna have to deal with that uh this is how we win the game We've got Battle at Wulong Forest we've got Battle at the Fire Nation Palace and Battle at Sing Se much like villains and heroes, they have a cost, and they also now have an effect whenever he turns in that direction, which uh -huh. is all bad. Which are very, very bad, because um, it'll deal damage to all heroes everywhere, even on off turns. Um, so it's welcome to the end of the game. <laughs> um, but we have hope. We. Uh, Mom is very well built up over there. So go ahead, pick where you are going. Um, Let's see. You you are better. Blues, yellows. So I wouldn't go here. How are you on Earth? Uh, we're the same on Earth. Because yeah. this battle at uh, Sing Se needs the three Earth yeah. and one arrow. What's the big one need over there? The Battle of Wulong needs... Oh, that's actually... Yeah, we need to take that one out first. Because we have a lot of blue characters. Yeah. Uh, it takes one of everything to one hit it. One of everything. One of everything. So, um, go ahead and flip. Just hope he doesn't turn that way. Good! He doesn't turn that way. He's going... One damage to all fire heroes. That includes you and I. So that'll be one to Boulder and one to Zhang Zhang. Yep. Oh, and he still damages everyone here as per normal. Okay, two blue, two green. A free blue. A yellow or a blue. I would recommend the yellow. I go yellow. And I could try to give you a free green die. 
think we need it right now. It might not be bad to hold it because of this one. Yeah. So we'll hold it for this trip. Yeah. So you would need... <laughs> So, so, to hit it once, you need one arrow, one earth, one fire, one water. Okay. If you want to take it out, you need two of each. So, double doubles are your friend right now. You got the double arrows. There is, between us, there is double earth. But I would, I would currently... You could change this water into something. Um, I would take the reroll. Yeah, because you, you've already you've already put down a card. Yeah, so I'll do that. Yeah. Good luck. Come on, thank you. Yeah, doubles of something would be great. Come on. Doubles. Double double earth, double water. All we need is double fire, which you cannot get with what you have. Right. But you have the change water to any symbol. Right. You change water to a fire. Boop. Yeah. This is done here. You have High Bay's ability to save someone's bacon, which Uncle Iroh's about to drop. Why don't we save him? Okay. And Everybody over here is looking pretty good. Yeah. And I mean, we, we still have this in case yeah. of emergency. Yeah. Um, this isn't going to do you any favor, so you can try to roll and get Katara's ability. Alrighty. Yeah, good luck. Thank you. You did not. Nope. But that's okay. Th th this is perfect. You knocked out this in one go. So, you will get two pie shows, because it works just like I Actually, keep those down for a second. I'm going to double check the pie shows. Um, ba 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 Play it continues. Fire Nation takes two damage. After completing, turn it over, gain the rewards. Um, I'm just gonna check the pie show tokens. Uh, during players can use any number. Villains, heroes abilities, damage. They have villains. Do 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 do. Interesting. I don't know if we get Pi Show for that. I'm gonna have to ask. I will have to reach out to Pat and ask. Um, we'll find out. I'm gonna probably play because there are rewards on the other side. Mm -hmm. I would assume we don't. Yep. So we're 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 gonna err on the side of harder. Yep. And just grab the reward off the back of this. After completing this battle, choose one player to roll an additional die of their choice their next turn. Go for it. <laughs> I mean, it's, it would be mine anyway, yeah. but oh, there's your thingy you. back. Um, so that's one battle done. Great job. Thank you. All right, I'm going to come to the Battle of Ba Sing Se. Do you want to flip the Fire Nation? Of course he's turning my way. Sorry. Mm, okay, so first uh, he does the natural damage. One to here, one to here, uh, one, two, three. Two, two. Um, there's not enough left over for him right now. You will take a damage as per normal. Now, damage to all green and red heroes in this location. Um, one damage removed from all villains, that's fine. And plus one to all green. You don't have a single green. And there's only this one, and Baldur is about to drop anyway. The good news is we can heal. Yep. <laughs> um, that's what it's for. That is definitely what it's for. So I'm definitely going to spend my green to grab a bonus green. So my normal pull, two blue, two green. Yep. The bonus green for the die. Right. Mom gifted me the uh, the reward, so I'm going to take the bonus green because we need we need a lot of those. Um, can I have a free arrow, and I get a bonus blue or a red. I both aren't that great, so blue it is. Let's go red, just something different, because then maybe I can try to save uh, Chitsang. Um, but for coming here, 
plus one pie show if your team is in location with a villain. There are two. There's a free up arrow. Yes. Now I don't have to worry about the up arrows. Yeah. Um, curious. Okay, let's see what we can do. Thank you. Okay, there is two earth for this. And I'm gonna take the reroll. So I need a grand total of six earth on that. Come on. Um, so I do have to put one down. Well, there's three. Yeah. Oh, yeah. but. But, but, but. This is my chance. This is my better chance to roll a double. So. The question is do I use my free reroll now? Reroll any unused die. Okay. So I'm going to reroll all these. I'm going to keep that one off. To, nah, I'm going to reroll it. I'm, I'm using my free reroll. That's happening. There's my double. Um, so I'm at four, five, six, two arrows. The battle is going to be done. Thank goodness. Good job. Oh, that's fire symbols galore. Okay. Yeah, we'll try to rescue him. I got two fire. I just need to roll a water. Is there water? There is a water. Good job. Thank you. Roll that for giggles. Oh, a double water. Huh. Great. If it would have been an arrow, I could have saved a token. Um, but the before we go to the end, can we heal one from two people? Yep. Thank you. So the boulder will heal one. Do you have anyone else who will die here? Not really. Because um, he's gonna heal. I'm gonna take one off of Uncle. Okay, do. Yep. So, so this goes bye bye. Yep, that goes bye bye. Thank you for that. Yep. Um, bye bye bye. Okay, not bad at all. One more to go. Yep, that was a lot of tokens for that, but it's the time to do it. And remove one damage from any four heroes. I'm gonna go one, two. Um, I'm sitting pretty good over here. Not bad. Okay, so three for him. Four. Who would be a decent fourth? Um, four. Cool. Not bad at all. Okay, that is. All right. My well, turn done. We know where oh. we're going. <laughs> Real quick. Hey, it's another baddie. It is Colonel Monkey. Ooh, and hope he turns, because that's a bad villain. Okay. Take the Fire Nation. He unfortunately stays put, right. which is what I wanted to avoid. Um, good news. He won't do a thing. She won't do a thing, but he is plus one damage to each hero on the active player's team. So they all take a hit. They all take a hit. Soup. 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 <laughs> I need another red one. Soup. Nope. He, yeah, I was going to say, I, I, I zooped it. Thank you. Soup. <laughs> Um, you do get a free pie show because of your uh, allies were hit. Free fire, fire symbol, which is perfect. Because uh, now in this area, you need two arrows, two fire, and four water for this battle at Fire Nation Palace. Okey so there's your two and two. Here is your free blue. And I'm assuming you want the yellow for the chance of the double arrow? Yep. All right, you you have the best shot of finishing this. <laughs> you have the double arrow, nicely done. You have a fire. So fire with this is done. We need four water. You have an ability to change a water to any symbol. Yep. So you could change this to the double. That would be great. Do that. Now. You have a water here that you could put down. And then out of these two, you just need one water, and we finish the game. 
Okay. We'll do that. Okay. <laughs> now, all you need to do is roll fire or water. Fire or water. Fire or water. Fire or water. Yep. Come on. Nope. Neither. Neither. <laughs> oh, boy. Um, we're going to spend this one. <laughs> water. 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 Or water. fire. Come on. Nope. Nope. Okay. Well, you're definitely going to want to use High Bay's ability to heal. Yep. And the good news is you still deal one damage to this. Um, I will give you this token back. Because with what you have on this, it does the one damage. High Bay, yeah, High Bay gets to heal somebody for one. If you haven't done that already. I'm, nope. I'm not the dire straits. Um... Anybody in the up there need to be healed? Mm. Uncle Iro? Yeah, go for it. Cool. All right. Well, hey, hey, it's all right. It's all right. Maybe, <laughs> maybe I maybe it's my time to redeem myself from what happened before. I'm going there, Fire Nation, please. He is turning. Grand Grand's taking a hit for us again. Thanks, Grand Grand. She's quite a lady. <laughs> Darn right. Uh, two blue, two green. Floor die. <laughs> what color was it? I can pick it up later. Blue. <laughs> um, I get my bonus. I'm going to take a red because we need fire over here. The downside is I have to try to roll arrows. Come on. Um, I do have one free reroll. There's no villain in this location. None of my dudes were hit. Okay. Okay. Good luck. Thanks. Oh, well, there's an arrow. There. Oh, I only need one arrow, not double. Fire into water. That's all that was needed. Yeah, arrow, fire, to water. That's game. Good job. Woo! We done did it. We done did it. Oh, so, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, that is our round of Avatar Last Bender, Fire Nation Rising. What do you think? I like this game. I like this game, too. <laughs> it's a challenge. It is very much a challenge. And the, the nice thing is that Balance and Ruin track uh, has multiple, uh, multiple sides. So this is the side we played on, we could have done on this. Um, it goes up to three dots uh, for difficulty. So there, there's a lot of variation here. You can also change the difficulty up by uh, removing villains. We, we went hard on this. Because um, we were like, all right, we're, we're on the easy balance track, but let, let's ramp it up. Because we, we, we played Rising games before, but we put in every villain into the deck. Which, I mean, we, we saw most, which was huge. Um, neither of us are huge Avatar fans. Um, we, we've we watched the show. Um, not not all of it. We, we've seen several several episodes. En enjoyed it. Yeah. I, 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 have, I have no qualms against it. Uh, and sometimes I want to finish it because it, it was good. <laughs> um, so thematically, it's not as impactful for us is going to be for maybe you who are a big fan of Avatar. Um, and you can probably tell if I butchered some last names. Uh, or first names or last names. Sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Uh, the Oh, the other thing of full transparency, and hopefully I put it in the beginning on the bottom, I was a playtester for this game um, through uh, the op. Uh, but it was volunteer. Uh, no no skin in the game. Um, so any anything I say is my thoughts, my thoughts alone. Um, no influence which way or another. So, what are your thoughts? <laughs> so so I, I can uh, stay a little more neutral. No, like I said, it's not an easy game. No. But, it, but it's a fun game. How do you like it compared to the other Rising games? Because you, you and I have played um, Spongebob. We've mm -hmm. done um, Batman Who Laughs, uh, which we haven't done on the channel um, and we've done Thanos, and we haven't done SpongeBob on the channel yet either. But you, you and I have played. This is our fourth Rising game we've played 
together. I've played the Harry Potter one too. But what what are what are your thoughts on this one, especially compared to the others? I, I like I said, I like this one. I know the characters of the other ones a little bit better yeah. than these, but, but um, but it's still like I said, it's still fun to play, and it's yeah. And yeah e even if you know nothing about it, about it, if, if you're fine, yeah, you'll be fine. <laughs> you'll you'll be fine. It is. Uh, the, the 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 artwork and uh, the the pie show like every, everything is very nice and I I, I love this um, the the bounce ruin track to get to the end game yeah it's very much like the Batman who laughs which it's got that villain track at the top um, but in this one I love the fact that it's cards instead of the dice roll for how far that goes up the ruin track because yeah. especially in the Batman who laughs we roll so terribly in that that it's like oh we're at the end game and we're on like the third or fourth turn or something like that it's awful that way uh where this one it is um i, I want to say if you add up all the numbers on here it adds up to 12 which is roughly what the track is um so you know if you run through the deck roughly once it's gonna pop yeah yes. um but it's it's yeah, I I, re, I I like the differences of this. the the the, fi the final battle system is really cool. Um, I I am very surprised. Um, in all the other Rising games, the mini is painted. I mean, I sh yeah. I shouldn't say mini. He's pretty. He's pretty good size. Um, but he's he's unpainted. But I also like painting minis, so I'm not complaining. <laughs> uh, but for those who've played other of the Rising games, you're go you're go you're going to be surprised by that one. Um. Someday he'll be painted. Yeah, someday I'll paint him. Someday. Someday. Uh, he he's got he's got a really cool wash on him though, so all the details stick out. Um, because he's he's really cool detailed. Um, but yeah, sometime I'll sometime I'll paint him. Maybe maybe I'll put that up as an extra video sometime down the road. Um. So yeah, you have any other? Th oh, uh, what do you what do you think of um the team build side? Where because normally you just put the team out, they all do whatever. These have adjacency things. I like that. Good. I, I really do. I like that because it, it's it, it's like okay if I put him on. It, it's yeah, because Katara's uh, she gets her bonus die if uh, one yeah. you only need one of the two yeah. and you don't get both. Oh. Uh, has to be either the avatar symbol oh, or water. Water, and it's just like okay, you know, for that. And, yeah, like and your Hakoda if. Their damage or an adjacent to damaged on their yeah. turn, you get a pie show. Yeah. Um, yeah, and I, I got the same thing of uh, Chit saying late, mm -hmm. but I know when so we luckily we didn't get damaged by Hama in this one, but in our play that we did yesterday and before that, Hama has been a pain for us because it is, um, and I know you struggled with this of trying to figure out what it meant, uh, because hers was select one hero per team. You deal one damage to the selected heroes adjacent to each selected hero. Know. It's it's a little bit of a mess verbiage wise. I like if you follow it, it makes sense. Yeah, but <laughs> quickly, like like for me reading it to her, and she's like, "Wait, what?" <laughs> <laughs> um, so it's like, no, you 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 pick one, and Mom wanted to put the damage on him right away. It's like, no, 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 you do damage to those the adjacent. Person, yeah. To them, so you with him uh, with uh, Hama, you prefer to go to the outside, so only the one next uh, inside goes because it doesn't just wrap back around. No. Um, the so that's that was our one confusion with this system. Yeah. Um, there, there was another one where you deal damage to the two leftmost. Um, but yeah, this. I, I this is probably e even though the theme doesn't hit home for me like the the and, and not the theme like it, it it's in there it's pretty it, I I prefer the Batman I prefer the Marvel stuff over Avatar out of personal preference but gameplay wise right. this this is probably my favorite Rising I really like the gameplay in this it's really good um, it takes what the others do and amplifies it and the modularity of the difficulty is amazing <laughs> yep. 
I, I really I really like that of like oh okay we we changed the balance track to make it a little bit harder we can sub in uh, so many bad guys um, so many villains we can take some out we can put them all in so like I, I would say with all the villains and the easy we were on like a medium difficulty um, so you can kind of uh, and there, there's some there's some folks who I know aren't gonna like that they they want this is easy, this is medium, this is hard. They don't want the wishy-washy of like, well, you can add them, you can remove them. I, I, I prefer it because it's, I, I don't know, re replayability for me is huge with that. I like it that way too. Yeah, same. I really it's, do. It's nice because like when we did Thanos, it was always put as many villains in. Mm -hmm. um, and, and, uh, and normally in that one, it was... The when you ended the game was uh, you, you you picked a number of villains to defeat. Once you defeated that many, the game was over. We never played it that way. Right. We always played it till let's see if we can knock out all ten, or where we get knocked out. Yeah. Like what, what, once we lose, that's kind of where we ended up. This, this one is much more friendly that, that way. way. Of like, oh, you have one set thing you need to do. The villains you can add add in or take away to make that. But. I think that's everything. That's everything. Yep. Um, I know for you, some of the text is small, yep. but you 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 struggle with certain size <laughs> text just, and all that. Yeah. But uh, for for those of you who are more in mom's demographic, the text is small. <laughs> it is. It is little, but uh, it, it is little. And then, uh, l luckily, the symbols are pretty straightforward. I know sometimes you couldn't always see the two in the corner. Uh, um, but. But other than that, it's 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 just fun. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's a lot of fun. Um, mm -hmm. We like this. We recommend it. Um, it it's out and available, uh, I believe, right now. I would recommend it. Yeah, if you go, uh, yeah, to the Ops website or to your friendly local game store, if they've got it in, give give it a pickup. It's fun. We like it. Uh, hey, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs, thumbs up. up. Subscribe to the channel. We are still marching our way towards <laughs> a thousand subscribers. So please help us out yeah. in any way you can. Subscribing on YouTube is free. You just have to hit that button and it'll pop uh, pop up in your feed anytime we post new videos onto the channel. Uh, and share the video with others, yes. please. <laughs> uh, but otherwise... Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> please and thank you. <laughs> my, my, my mama didn't teach me my P's and Q's very well. She only taught me my P and not my Q. <laughs> I only said P and not thank you. <laughs> Well, I assume that's what the cue and please and thank you is. I'm rambling. Hey, everyone. <laughs> thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye.